Hi guys, so Shinga has been in season for the last few weeks, which has made some of her development and training very difficult. So we've given her a nice little rest. She's uh, thankfully uh, finished her season now, which has meant over the last week or two, we've been able to really focus again on some of the training and development that we have been doing with her. It's important that Shinga learns to track on different terrain, including hard surface, because when she's operational in Africa, she will be predominantly tracking on loose sand, which is a very difficult surface to follow human scent on. Teaching Shinga to track over different terrain and surfaces also allows her to learn to ignore distractor scents. This can be other wildlife, it can be other people, it can be lots of different environmental scents and smells. She needs to remain focused on following the poacher. Shinga is trained when she reaches the end of a track and locates the poacher to alert with a bark. This lets the handling team know that she's found the poacher and it allows her to keep the poacher completely under her control. All of our dogs are trained to apprehend any would-be poacher, but we instruct the handling teams to use this aspect of training only as a last resort. Through our specialist training, we make sure that our dogs are under our control at all times. As you can see here, Shinga responds quickly and effectively to the command from the handler. Shinga! Out! Even when she's under pressure from a poacher. Don't forget, you can help sponsor some of our anti-poaching dogs and their training by visiting www.dogsforwildlife.org. Thank you. Oh. <laughs>